Okay guys, as you can see by the title of the video, I am going to show you how to make um, an ID slot on the on your duct tape wallet. So I have made a duct tape wallet. It's a little guinea pig that I use for a lot of my videos. It's you can have one credit card, two credit cards, or how many credit cards you want on this side, and no credit card holders on this side. Sorry, these aren't credit cards, these are credit card holders. So for the you're gonna install I'm going to use paper for the sake of this video, but for the uh, ID slot, it'll go right there. But you should use plastic, and any hard plastic would be fine. Like, you could use the hard plastic from, for instance, a lot of things that have it. Like, you can buy yo-yo string that has really good plastic. Anything from pretty much just, like, dollar ammo would be pretty good. And so, yeah. But I think that the best thing to use is the sheets from overhead projectors that they used to make. If you don't know what that is, then sorry. But you, they have those at Staples, I know, and I think they have them at Target and maybe Grand, Grand Toy. I'm not exactly sure because I don't only really go to Staples and Target. So, uh, to attach it, you're going to make a piece of plastic, but mine's paper. You're going to take a piece of paper or plastic, yeah, you're gonna take a piece of plastic that measures four inches by two and a half inches. So, and it's gonna go in the middle of your wallet, just like this. It'll look pretty nice. So, it's a little bigger than uh, the credit card holders, kind of, because, well, they just are, whatever. And yeah, so let's start making them. What you're gonna do is you're gonna get out two strips of tape that are a quarter of an inch wide and two and a half inches long. You're gonna cut up two of those, and you're gonna get, cut out one strip of duct tape that's an inch wide and four inches uh, long. So first, what you're gonna do is you're going to attach the bottom of the ID slot, of the ID holder. So, you're going to put half of the duct tape on the bottom, whatever part you of the, the plastic that you want to use as the bottom, and you are going to take one of these, no, First, sorry, you're gonna line this up in kind of the middle of the wallet, like that, wherever you want it to be. I kind of like it in the middle of one of the halves. And you're gonna stick it down just like that and fold over. Uh, actually, no, you don't want to stick on half of the tape on the paper. Actually, no, yes, you do. Never mind, what am I saying? You're gonna go like that. You're gonna just stick it down as best as you can in the middle. So that's where it looks the nicest. And fold the rest of it over the other half. Now it should be kind of connected just like that. Kind of messed mine up a little bit. So you can see it's connected just like that. And that's perfect, just like that. And you're gonna take one of the super tiny strips. It's about this big, it's pretty small. And you're gonna let the wallet. Oh, uh, really? I accidentally did it on the back of the wallet instead of the front because I'm spaz. I'm complete spaz. So, wow, I've never done that before. So, you're gonna take over half of it, or in this case, I put over two thirds, and stick over the other half. That. Take one of the small strips and stick it over the side. Stick on about mm, half of it as best you can, just like that. The side's so now it's connected over there. The reason that these are so small is because you don't want it to bulk up on the back of the wallet a lot. And you're going to do the same on the other side. Like. This. It's like that. 
okay, perfect, just like that. And now you can see that there's this little pocket inside. Usually that would be made out of plastic, like I said before. And so now you have your wallet, walk around, la da da da. Go to the subway, the TTC, whatever, or whatever you go to. Say, oh, uh, do you have a Metro Pass? Oh, yeah, I do. It's right here. You can just open up your wallet, bam, your Metro Pass will be right in there. And so it's pretty cool. I really like to put them in. And thank you. If you like what you've seen here, please uh, subscribe to my channel. I'll have more videos up hopefully next week. And thanks. Yep. Goodbye.